This has got to be it. The maze bank. Let's go in. Let's find your baby. You can't park there. Production vehicles only. Come on, you dipshit. Ah, that host, man, he's like any closeted TV presenter. Bitter as fucking vinegar. Where the fuck are they? Hello, sir. May I please have your name? Where the fuck is Tracy Townley, huh? Tracy fucking DeSanta. Fuck, screw that. Where the fuck's Laszlo? <laughs> All right. Yeah. That was really. All right. It's the auditions, Fame or Shame, season 14, right here in Vinewood, San Andreas. Coming up next, it's Tracy DeSanta. Judges, Tracy DeSanta. Yes. <laughs> Hi. All right. Tracy's a dancer, but she also likes acting, modeling, and working with children. That's, that's beautiful. You're so original, like oh. a, a basket full of puppies or a <laughs> rainbow or a pile of puke. Oh. Who are these clowns? That's my dad and Trevor? Two dads. Uh, <laughs> Great. Wow. Very San Andreas. What are you guys doing here? Yeah, what are you uh, doing here? Okay, I'm back. Relax, chill, make yourself at home. We've got a little show to do here. Okay. Three, two, one. All right, it's fame or shame for Tracy DeSanta. Music! Take what your daddy's gave you, honey. Ooh, it does. Stop a twenty in this. Oh! <laughs> Fucking do something about this. Uh, uh, that's enough. Oh, oh! I said that's enough. Oh, 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 hey. I got security! Security! No. What you fucking Hold say? Come on, big guy! Come on, there! No! Go. no. Come here, you little shit! No. Tracy, go home. I just want to talk to you. Cheap shot coffee is a legend. How are you? I'm so fucking tired of this. Ah, they towed us. We got to take the truck. Sometimes I need a good laugh. There, we take the truck. I got a deposit on that truck. Let's get that prick. Look, he went left. How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Hey, you raise a daughter in this town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting. Now, thanks for the fucking feedback. It means a lot coming from you. We're gonna flatten his toy car in this big rig. Don't you worry. Fucking Laszlo. I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road. Trailer was slowing us down. We're right. He took a left. How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Hey, you raise a daughter in this town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting. Now, thanks for the fucking feedback. It means a lot coming from you. No one's getting in the way of the big rig. We'll flatten this dickhead. Fucking Laszlo. I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road! It's only a battery car, come on! This ain't exactly a racer.
We'll go faster without that trailer. Let's get that. I saw him turn left. How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Hey, you raise a daughter in this town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting. Now, yeah, thanks for the fucking feedback. It means a lot coming from you. We're gonna flatten his toy car in this big rig. Don't you worry. Fucking Laszlo. I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road. It's only a battery car. Come on. This ain't exactly a racer. He went left! How's it going? Ah, the little bastard's gone up through the train tracks. We can have a little fun with him, but let's not try to kill this prick, all right? When we crush his little toy car, who knows what'll happen to him? Hey, take a left up here. I knew this city would be full of douchebags. Can we speed it up a little, huh? Maybe by throwing your fat carcass over the side. He's gone round to the right. Right, right, here. Can't get enough of the celebrities, can you? Ten fucking minutes in L.S. Shut up! That cocksucker might be famous, but... Oh. We'll get him! We'll get him! But well, we're sure taking our time about it. Ah, ah! He's going down into the L.S. River. I can see that. I hate that closeted man whore on the TV. I hate him on the radio. The little shit's all out of juice. Oh, hey, 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 hey you guys. You run out of batteries, huh? I didn't mean anything by it, all right? Oh, yeah? Well, that little girl sat on my lap when she was two years old, and I swore to God that I would rip the fucking skin off anyone who fucking wronged her. Look, I'm just a dumb A-list celebrity trying to entertain America, okay? I got a lot of stuff going on right now, dude, besides you trying to kill me. Now I got multiple sexual harassment lawsuits, plus I'm an addict, all right? And I've relapsed. I can't stop jacking, dude. I jack it in traffic. What's your talent, uh, huh? I mean, aside from love and sex. Dude, haven't you seen my show? It's not live, it's not funny. That's my genius, I got no fucking talent. You clearly ain't being humble, T. Uh, you proved your point. Uh, this is your daughter. You should be wanting to rip the fucking ponytail off the back of this guy's head. And you! Uh, Pants off. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. There you go. Uh, uh, All right. What are you doing now? I want you to dance sexy, celebrité, mm hmm I mean, I need music, or... Are you trying to fucking annoy me, huh? I'll dance. Good. <laughs> what the fuck is that? All right, all right, now drop it like it's hot, all right? I want to see you get nice and low. Come on, lower, lower, come on. Oh, oh, please don't kill me, okay? I'm supposed to be on a magazine cover next week. All right, all right, come on, get no. up. Take off, go, now. Before I change my mind. I got it all on my camera, you fucking pussy. The world's gonna see your shit. <laughs> I'm going home. How the fuck did you do it without me for nine years, huh? <laughs> oh, shit. Dave. We need to talk. I was about to tell you the same thing. Okay. Meet me at Galileo Observatory as soon as you can get there. Okay.
like a tough guy. Ah! No way, dwarf things. Motherfucker! Trevor? You called? No shit! What's happening? My ex-wife called me again. Man! There is nothing worse in this world than an ex-wife. Perpetual reminder of life's mistakes. A dreadful mistake. She's thinking of suing me again. For what? You live in a trailer. She heard my radio show. If she heard your radio show, she should pity you, not sue you. <laughs> That's nice, Trevor. No, Ron. It's not. It's unkind, but it's also true. Your ex-wife was a bitch! I did you the favor of a lifetime when I scared her off. You did. You really did. If after 12 years of happy marriage, one simple threat of dismemberment was enough to send her running, well, I don't know. And she... The answering machine is being monitored. Be careful what you say. They're listening. Oh my god. Sorry, lady.
wonderful. A veritable treasure trove. 